Hello and welcome. Replacement decision. Let's discuss a case of individual replacement and considering the time value of money. The brief data available is the cost of the asset is rupees 60,000, salary value or scrap value or resale value is zero at any point of time. That means the depreciation cost every time will be 60,000 minus zero equals to 60,000. Running cost is given to be rupees 10,000 for the first five years. Every year only 10,000. But increasing by rupees 3,000 in the sixth and the subsequent years. So in the 6th year it will be first time 13,000 in 7th year, 16,000 in 8th year, 19,000 and so on. The company expects a return of 10% on all its investments. That means this rate we should consider as for calculation of present value factor or discounting factor. And that will be 1 divided by 1 plus 0.1 that is 10 by 100 raised to n years. Because if there is no other information, the compounding is always believed to be on the yearly basis. So the final PV factor will be 1 divided by 1.1 raised to n. We shall multiply the running cost with PV factor. So the result will be present value of PV factor. Cumulative PV or other present value of running cost. Summation of this column. Cumulative. Uh, we shall add the depreciation cost 60,000 minus 0 equals to 60,000 to the cumulative running cost. So the result will be total cost. And that total cost will now be divided by cumulative PV factor instead of number of years as in the case of model 1. Now in this model 2, we shall divide the total cost by cumulative present value factor instead of number of years. And the result will be weighted average of total cost. Yearly average. Let's start. The first year running cost 10,000. I have already calculated the present value or discount factors. You can also calculate for 8 to 10 years and write. Because to calculate PV factor on a simple calculator is a continuous process. 1 divided by 1.1. Equal to will be the first, then equal to will be the second, then equal to will be the third. So it can be calculated continuously for so many years. So you can write for 8 to 10 years continuously. There is no problem whether you use it, them or not. First is 0 0.9091 multiplied by 10,000. So it will be 9,091 rupees. First cumulative is the first running cost itself. 60,000 depreciation cost, original cost 60,000, constant salvage value is 0. So 69,091. The first PV factor remains same, rather cumulative PV factor. In first case, we are not going to calculate average. Second year, again 10,000. The second PV factor is 0 0.8264. So 8,264 8, is the present value of running cost payable in the second year or at the end of the second year, 6,264. The cumulative will be 17,355. Depreciation cost 60,000. So 77,355 total cost. Now cumulative PV factor, addition of these two is 1.7355. And now divide this total cost by this cumulative PV factor. 77,355 divided by 1.7355. The result is 44,572. Okay, the third year, again 10,000. The P factor for the third year is 0.7513. I have already calculated all these things so that in writing and explaining no additional time is needed. I want to save your time of studying this through this video lecture. Yes, uh, 7513. The cumulative will be 24868. 
60,000 as usual depreciation cost. Total is 84,868. The cumulative PV factor comes to 2.4868. Divide this cost by this cumulative PV factor and result is 36,127. Fourth year, 10,000 running cost till 5 years, 0. 0.6880. So 6,880. The cumulative PV of running cost comes to 31,698. No, it should not be 98. There is gap of 30. It should be 748. There is a mistake in writing in the fur. Add 60,000 depreciation cost. It will be 91,748. The cumulative comes to 3.1698. 28,928. You can have different last two digits. So please calculate. Don't write directly from this. Number 5. Still running cost is 10,000 till 5 years. 0. 0.6209. So 6,209. Cumulative will be 37,955. 57 rather. Add 60,000 depreciation cost, 97,957. The cumulative PV factor comes to 3.7907. And divide the total cost by cumulative PV factor. That will be 25,828 or maybe last two digits may be different because there was a mistake of 30 rupees at this stage. Sixth year. Now from the sixth year, the running cost is going to increase by 3000 every year. So it is 13,000. Cumulative, rather, PV factor first comes to 5645. Now multiply it by 13,000. So the amount will not be more or less similar with statistics. 7338. Cumulative will be 45,295. Okay. Add 60,000. It will be 1,45,295. Cumulative PV factor will be 4.3552. And Divide the total cost by the cumulative PV factor, so it will be 24,100 something. It is 65 in my rough work. Seventh year. Still this is decreasing, so we have to continue to write the data for more and more number of years. 13 plus 3, 16,000. PV factor for the seventh year comes to 0 0.5131. Multiplication of these two, 16,000 into 0 0.5131 is 8,209. Cumulative present value of running cost comes to 53,504. Add 60,000. It is 1,13,504. Cumulative PV factor comes to 4.8683 and divide the total cost by cumulative PV factor. The result is weighted every total cost per year that comes to 23,300 something. 23,300 something. I speak something because There was a mistake of 30 or 50 rupees somewhere. So you can have different last two digits. I'm very sorry, but in a hurry, I made some mistake in my rough work. 16 plus 3, 19,000. But conceptually, there is no error. So be bold and follow me. Yes, again, for the 8th year, the factor comes to 0.4665. 
0.4665 into 19,000 that is 8,863. Cumulative comes to 62,367. Add 60,000 depreciation cost, 1 lakh 22,367. The cumulative PV factor comes to 5.3348. Divide the total cost by cumulative PV factor to get the weighted average total cost per year. It comes to approximately 22,909. Still it is decreasing, so we have to continue. It is something like trial and error method, but there is no error. A slight difference because of error of 50 rupees somewhere you can have the last two digits different from the digits I am writing. Ninth here. Hopefully there can be something. Because this has come very close to the weighted average. So, let's hope we get minimum in this year. Yes, present value factor for ninth year comes to 0 0.4241. Multiplication of these two will be 9330. 71,697 cumulative PV of running cost. Add depreciation cost 60,000. It is 131,697 cumulative PV factor 5.7589 and approximately 22,859. Yes. Now, in the 10th year, the running cost will be 25,000, which is greater than the previous weighted average total cost, yearly weighted average. So, this is the stage from where we should discontinue to use this particular asset. At this stage itself, we can say that at the end of the 9th year, we should replace this asset by the new one. Let's complete this, 0.3856 the PV factor, present value of running cost comes to 9639, there may be some difference in the last digit because of the uh, rounding off of the decimal values, 81200, rather 336, add 60,000. 1,41,336 and 6.144 comes to the cumulative PV factor and if we divide, see gradually it has started to increase 22,993 or around 23,000 so this one is the lowest This one is the lowest at, in, at the end of the ninth year. Or another criteria, full proof. In the tenth year, the running cost exceeds the minimum weighted average total cost per year. So ninth year is the key. In the beginning of the tenth year or before starting the work, work for the tenth year or Exactly on the last day, at the closure of the last day of the ninth year, we should discontinue to use this asset. It should be replaced by its new version. So, the conclusion is, in this case, it is advisable for the company or for the firm to replace the asset at the end of the ninth year or before starting the work in the beginning of the tenth year. This was the case considering the time value of money. There is not much difference in the format of this statement in model 1 and in model 2. This is model 2. All the columns of model 1 are there but because of introduction of the present value factor there are some new columns and we have to consider the present value of running cost instead of absolute value of running cost. That's it. Thank you very much.